Hello everyone, and welcome to Netlink Daily, I'm Walter Cronkite. No? Okay. No. I'm sorry. Remember Big Dog? He was a pack mule robot created by Boston Dynamics that could keep trekking through pretty much any terrain. Now if that wasn't awesome slash terrifying enough, now the same company has created Atlas, a 6 foot 2, 330 pound robot. He's designed for disaster relief and will be trained to navigate degraded terrain and even drive utility vehicles. I'm not even going to make any Skynet references, this blows my mind. Most smartwatches like Samsung's Galaxy Gear, oh look I'm wearing a watch now, the Pebble, and Qualcomm's Toke, Tuck, toke, tuck? Have to tether to a smartphone to be truly useful, but the Neptune Pine, developed by 19-year-old Simon Tian, will take a micro SIM card and basically be a smartphone in a watch. A smartwatch. The device will text, make calls, video chat, and has two cameras for taking pictures. The Pine's Kickstarter blew past its original goal, so hit the link below to check it out. Speaking of wearable tech, Sony's PS4 was all the rage this week, but now they want to move into the smart wig business. Yes, you heard that right. The company filed a patent for a wig containing a circuit board that could wirelessly communicate with other devices and provide tactile feedback to the user. Here's hoping they come out with a next-gen head massage game for PS4. Mmm. And guess what? NCIX is having another warehouse sale at our headquarters in Richmond, yeah! It's this Saturday, November 23rd. The doors open at 9 a.m. and close at 5.30 p.m. You probably want to get in there early to snag a good spot in line. Hit the link in the description for all the details. All right, that's it for Nailing Daily, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more tech news, reviews, and tutorials, and I will see you on another time. And that's the way it was. No, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay.